This week marks the 50th anniversary of the Clean Water Act to protect American rivers, lakes, and oceans from pollution. While there's no doubt that many waterways are healthier than they were before, Adam Smith, a USC Viterbi Associate Professor of Civil and Environmental Engineering, says there's still more progress to be made. Smith says we're at an important point in time where dramatic shifts can occur in the way we value, treat, and reuse water. The Viterbi student organization, The Athena Project, is gearing up for its annual hackathon event with pre-registration open now and full registration open in November. The 2023 hackathon has an arcade theme and a 24-hour event taking place in February. We are a beginner-friendly hackathon that is targeting to close the gender gap in hackathons. So our hackathon is 24 hours long, so it runs over a weekend. There's absolutely no experience necessary and we're open to all majors, not just computer science. Abigail Horn is using data to improve food, safety, and nutrition. This article, now featured on our website, explains how the new research assistant professor in Viterbi's Department of Industrial and Systems Engineering has built her career by using data and computer science to help combat foodborne disease outbreaks that have seen worrying increases across the country. Bo Jin, a research scientist in Viterbi's Department of Aerospace and Mechanical Engineering, was recently recognized by the American Society of Composites. As this year's winner of the Young Composites Researcher Award, Jin is recognized as a member of the composites community who has made a significant impact on the science and technology of composite materials. That's all for this week. For more information on these stories and more, just head to our website, viterbyschool.usc.edu.